So here we are, man, Tabers. 2022 Game and Country Fair, East Anglia Game and Country Fair at Houston Park. Here's back. It is a bit windy. Here are all our engines. Here are the tractors. So, let's have some steam going on over the back there. Roll the credits and we'll have a look around. Aha! Welcome to the Man Cave. Let the games begin. So let's go into the engine pen and see what we got. I see we have an LD1 diesel lister. Not up and running yet. Here we have Lister Junior, also known as the Lister B. This is like mine, but the hopper cooled version. 1949 this one. Lovely, lovely little engine. Running sweeter than that. That's driving a corn mill. Here we have a Douglas running a Lister pump. There's our lovely little Lister pump. Excuse the wind noise. There's the 1950 Douglas SV1. Here's one you'll recognize. The old PB8 of mine, 1929. Isn't she beautiful? Here she is running her Broomway compressor. Let's flick on these compressors. Oh, noisemaker. Quiet mode. Here we have our lovely Trust Love pump. Look at you, Michelle. Look at that. The lubrication look. No oil pump. That's all just picking up on that gear and squeezing it through that little sun wheel at the top there. And look how that keeps that lubricated. Isn't that beautiful? You've all seen my trusty Lister B. Absolutely beautiful. Let's move around to the 1930 Bamford. EG1, owned by a friend of mine, Dave, lovingly restored, isn't she beautiful? With the Leo water pump and a lovely little selection of cans, isn't this lovely? My favourite engine of the show is this Crossley. I do like the Crossley, it's the 1030 from 1928. Listen to that go. Absolutely beautiful. I do love a Crossley. I will have to get the man cave one of them one day. I love them. This is cute. Look at that. For scale, here's my hand. Beautiful little nodding donkey pump running off a little town gas engine. A little quarter horsepower, babe. And there it is beside a four kilo gas cylinder. I mean, look how small that is. That tiny little oiler on there. This is just adorable. Open crank, water cooled. Listen to that. Isn't that absolutely lovely? Here we have relatively original looking Lister D. Running a water pump. There we go. Gotta have a Lister D, and wherever we go, we gotta have a Lister D. Here's another Lister D, look a little bit more restored this one. I think this one he said to 48, running a power hacksaw. There we go. So that is all the engines at the show. Oh, uh, she's pumping Avatar blood. <laughs> Lovely, aren't they? Lovely. Right, we'll have a look around the tractors and then we'll come back. So we're going to kick off with the array of lawnmowers. That's a tiny little hater. Whether that's a haterette, I'm not sure. No, this one's the haterette. Not sure what that one is. That is the smallest lawnmower I've ever seen. That must really be a 12 inch cut. There you go. I mean, it's only got a little three, three and a half on there, but the cut is barely wider than the lawnmower. So the haterette, we have another old hater of some description, 
20 inch cylinder mower and what looked like a pair of hater condors. This one appears to be road registered. We have some mini tractors, some gut boards. You can't beat a gut rod. There we go. I think that looked like there's a couple of gut rods here. And then we have a little auto truck. Isn't that lovely? Hard boy Honda, which is a shame. A Jacobson Chief and a little three-cylinder diesel. Look at that, three-cylinder diesel. Ford, as you can see, it's an LG T14D. A British motorboat, BMB, British motorboat, garden tractor. And the Kubota B7101. Isn't this lovely? 7001. Yeah, 7001. Lovely. I do like Kubotas. I know they're Chinese, but they are like full size tractors in miniature. Three point linkage, hydraulics. Yeah, they're miniature. They are lovely. Very powerful, actually. And four wheel drive. Wheel horse, Commando 7. Another wheel horse. No, these are not mine. Nice to see it's got the original cola on there. Oh, I'll bring my wheel horses, really. And we have another wheel horse. Again, Honda powered, which is a shame. Should have a cola on. It should have a cola, a bigger version of that one. Very nice. Been nicely restored, that one. And here we have... The gentleman who brings some of these tractors also brings his lorry, which is a nice... Really nice wagon for a 97, That's, he looks after that, he really does. And then we have the Majors. I don't need to say a lot, you can read them on the front. Couple of Grey Fergies, we've also got Grey Fergies. And a McCormack International. That looks a nicely restored tractor as well, not overly done. That's pretty much how it would have been when it left the factory. It hasn't got a... It's not been overly restored on the paintwork. I've really noticed that. Here we have another grey Fergie. Plenty of grey Fergies. Here we go. A little bean carrier with a side winch. And a John Deere. You know me and John Deere's. And we have a 80s and a 90s Ford. It's nice to see these old, I remember these things working on the fields, I remember when they were new tractors actually. It's hard to think now that these are actually rally exhibits, but they are. I suppose some small Holdens would still run them. I mean this is a hell of a tractor, these wheels are the best part of six feet high, they're head height on me, so these are fairly big wheels. I don't know what size them wheels are. I'm looking for a tire, so it's 38 inch, so 460, 85, 38. So she's a sizable old Ford, that. Sizable old Ford, she's nice. She is nice. Anyhow, I'm going to keep this video short as we can. So here we go. This is our little display at Game and Country Fair, East Anglia. We have all the stalls set up along the bottom ooh orb balls maybe try them later we have a steam engine up here look someone's made a miniature steam engine we'll perhaps have a look at them in another video there we go so that's going to be it for this video we will be back for another video very shortly I'll probably not do another video tomorrow or even later on today. Well, thank you for watching. Like and subscribe to the channel. And we will be back very soon. Bye bye for now. Ha <laughs> ha!